Hello everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to use the page builder row separator feature of the Ascend theme. If you take a look at this home page, I'm sure you can notice these cool little transitions between the page builder rows. Well these are actually built into the Ascend theme and quite easy to configure, so I'll show you how to do that very quickly. Now if you take a look here, you can see I've got a default page builder page set up, and you can see just the straight line separators for each one of the rows. Not bad, but the row separators really just kind of make things flow a little bit better in my opinion. So I'll show you how to get this set up real fast. Alright, so first of all you're going to want to navigate to the edit page screen for the page in question. And let's start at the bottom. We'll go into the edit row area in page builder. Click the design tab. And be sure to take note of whatever color below this row. The, whether it's your footer or another page builder row, I know what the color of the footer is here, so I'm just going to add that in. And let's choose our separator. Let's try the center triangle. That should look cool. And let's move on up to the next row. Well, first of all, let's get that background color so we can get it matched up. Let's copy the background color of the first row. Let's go to the next row. Click the design tab again and let's paste that color in we'll select the left triangle and we'll copy that background color once again go to the top row hit the design tab one more time paste that color and let's choose a right triangle for this hit update page Scroll to the top and refresh. And just like that, we've got the row separators configured. It really is that simple. And there's a lot of options you can do within this. You can even change the color if you want those to stand out even more. But I prefer to just have the color match the background of the next row. And that's it. That's all you need to do to configure the row separators. Thanks for watching the video, and as always, post up on the forums if you have any further questions regarding row separators or anything else. Thank you.